So for today's adventure, we're going to be taming up a Reaper King, which means that I need to find a Reaper Queen and then basically get pregnant. So this is going to go very well. I can already tell. Um, all right, let's head on into the Zinner's biome. You may notice we do have a light pet. I just quickly tamed one up right there. It was a 168 and it took two of those seeds that you can actually buy from Helena's shop. Um, I'm just thinking actually, you know what? Let me leave a shadow main out here because I don't I don't see this going well at all. Wait, what one is this? Oh yeah, and I, I never renamed this one. So that's uh that's a replacement for the female that we lost a couple days ago. What the hell just happened there? It just turned like very bright. Okay. Uh let's hit on in here. So Reaper Queens. Um I, I've had a lot of experience with Reaper Queens and getting pregnant via them. Um, you may remember episode 100 of the Cluster series a couple weeks ago. We did 100 Reaper Queens in one single video. That sounds so wrong. Uh, well, I technically it was just one queen, um, but I birthed 100 males, uh, the kings. So yeah, uh, that was a very hectic day and my chest still kind of hurts, even though this is a different character and everything. Um, we're gonna hopefully try to find one of these things here today. I do believe that they only spawn in the furthest area So let me actually just get over here and turn on my tech helmet just so we have that on I think you could do it. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to hit R. That's gonna throw the light pet off Okay, let's see that doesn't when you're on a mount by the way uh, Okay, here we go. Can I stop? Okay, there we go. Sweet so, um, yeah, we're gonna have to search into the deepest area of this biome to try and find ourselves a queen that is fit for making me a father to a king. Very strange stuff. All right. Oh, I can already hear a reaper. Uh, I don't know where it is, though. I could just hear it swinging. It's, it's, oh, maybe it's down below. I'm pretty sure only the king spawned down here, but it might be worth having just a quick look just in case. You never know. Yeah, that's a king down there. I can notice by the tail. So, um, yeah, hopefully we can find a queen here today. We're going to have to do a good search, though. Um, I'm not going to build a trap unless I can get it to completely leave this biome, because if I can't, then it's probably not worth doing that. You can't build down here by default, so I'm not going to try and just build a trap, even though I might technically be capable of doing that on my server. We're not going to do that. Um, pretty sure it's the last area, not down here, right? We might end up finding some down there, but there's a lot of summoners around here. Like I said in the, uh, the Knuckle and Taming episode, those things are very dangerous. You don't want to mess with them. Like, honestly, they are really, really dangerous and not worth fighting at all. Let's just run through all these guys right here. And this should be the area that we can hopefully try to find a Reaper Queen. And that one right there is a king. All right, let's, uh, just run into this area here. Um... And quickly just take out these weird little tentacle plant thingies by just hitting them once and let's fight our way through everything now because they're all gonna come for me oh my god guys go ahead do me a favor hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one um really hoping this goes well. <laughs> okay boom there we go we did a nice little ult on that guy and now let me move no okay i did it sweet i i don't want to get like acid burned or whatever let me quickly just eat up this tentacle as well it only takes one hit to break those which is great i like that definitely uh a lot better than potential for like those tentacles to be like rockwell's actual big tentacles those ones are the worst all right come on come on all right we'll just kill all these dudes okay so we could probably take a little look around here maybe by just running down to this bottom part but we seriously need to be careful down here like these summoners are definitely not a creature that you want to mess with like they're probably the most dangerous creature in arc right now i would say um and i don't say that just as like a big clickbaity thing i'm being 100 percent serious i'm actually afraid of them like they're really really scary um so yeah we don't want to mess with them like uh, they can summon in pretty much mm, like any creature like feroxes i've seen which is terrifying because feroxes can knock you off your mount i'm pretty sure they can get shadow mains too so like that's even more terrifying shadow mains will probably just destroy your mount as well so yeah um why are all of these guys oh i don't think they're why aren't they aggro to me some of them weren't there a second ago that was weird okay let's just ult and kill some things are we good oh no summoner got me okay hang on we're just gonna fly away because well, jump away i guess because i don't want to mess with them i really don't um is it still coming for me okay we lost it that's good um so yeah, this might be a bit of a messy episode because I don't know how long it's going to take me to actually find some queens. Now we're completely stuck. There we go. All right, let me just go ahead and kill this one as well. There we go. Nice. The collisions on this map are so odd sometimes. All right, we do have... Oh my God, look at... Th There's a magma sword down there from the summoner. Do you see this? This is what I'm talking about. I don't want to fight a magma sword. I don't want to get burned. 
that's totally what would happen i would probably end up getting like the aoe burn from it look at this thing it should have like weird spots all over it yeah you can see it looks like it has like a weird disease but that is a magma source spawned in by the summoner yeah don't mess with them i'm being serious okay let's uh can we get up here can we jump can is it gonna one more no okay let's do a super jump then i really didn't want to have to do that but here we go and awesome so here's rockwell's heart um maybe we can kind of like work our way over the other side try and see if we could find any of these dudes okay we just gotta there's so many things down here and being like absolutely bombarded by creatures constantly <laughs> <laughs> all right so we're gonna try and use the uh the method that i've probably had spammed in my comments like 50 billion times ever since like the very start of this dlc this acid down here does damage you can bring the reaper queen in there and basically have it damage itself on the acid until it's ready to actually um give a baby to you because you have to get it down to i think it's like 10 percent or something like that to actually have it ready to um to want to give birth or whatever i think it might be five percent health to be honest but they do have a lot of health anyway so hopefully that doesn't take too long but i did fall into the acid a couple episodes ago actually technically that footage did not make it into the video so i did fall into the acid and it did like 700 damage uh, a tick to my shadow main which is terrifying so maybe it won't take that long um i feel like turning off this uh this tech helmet because it's kind of becoming just a little bit too much here um to be honest i'm also kind of tempted to put away my uh life pet just in case let me actually get up here this uh this search is going to be quite dangerous so um i'm gonna just get down here see what we can find if we can't find a good level i'll probably just bring you guys back when we do because otherwise this video could potentially be 10 hours you never know how long i'll end up having to spend down here so yeah here we go boom all right we're gonna chuck you off we're gonna pick you up I just don't want to potentially get like knocked off and have that thing die so for the best 100 percent. all right let's do that and let's head on into this area i can easily just try and look around for these summoners like they're they're pretty big and they do also shine light as well so if i see that i know just stay away from it let's see do we have any queens though hmm. hopefully we do hopefully we do come on there we go all right we're getting element shards uh which is kind of just the norm down here like you get a lot of really good materials from just harvesting the weird bits in this biome um let's see do we have oh reaper queen yes it is look at the tail all right let me move over here and then i'll try and check its level i don't want to potentially get bombarded by it that is a level 30 that sucks okay so plan is to get back here pull out my light pet and then we'll go and slay that reaper queen and then that will actually give us some of the um the little uh pheromones which technically are not you know you don't need them but it's kind of handy to have them i suppose um all right we don't want to lose my shadow main to all these dudes these things are so aggressive i'm being serious like this is ridiculous <laughs> get out of here man leave all right we're good i think we're good all right here's my light button you light up there we go wait did that work or okay are we lit up now okay we're not in charge though it's not showing me any charge that's weird we're not hmm okay oh there's a max level something nearby which is good um so the reaper queen was somewhere around here there's so many things in this biome that just slow you down like we've got spiders everywhere uh is this the queen I'm gonna just assume it is uh because it's pretty, pretty much at the exact same spot that the other one was so here we go let's just work our way through this queen come on try and get an ult in i missed that completely why is it running away from me come on these things look sick by the way i'm so excited to actually get a, a king here because like they look so much better than the ones on aberration like the ones on aberration look good i've always liked reapers but like now that they have like a new look i feel like i'm never gonna want the other ones ever so yeah um you don't have to worry about the arthros bit it shouldn't be too much of an issue come on oh you know what we can check its health right here by doing that and it's still got a lot it's got like 30k left and that missed completely great all right let's do a little shock very nice that's actually a great way of getting behind a creature by the way just like double tapping right click getting the little arrow on the creature and then like teleporting for the shock it's great it really is do that again oh we can't do it yet can we there we go sweet all right buddy oh my god you better stop it's also great if you're like slowed down and you want to get to a creature boom that should have hit but it did not okay 
Oh my god. What is hitting me now? We were gooed by something. Uh, I think it's probably those tentacles. Okay, here we go. How close are we? We're getting closer. Oh my god. These queens are no joke. Boom. Did I hit you? Yes, I hit it with my ult. Amazing. Okay. So this thing should die pretty soon. I guess I could just quickly get a king from this, but it's not really worth my time. I'm going to hopefully try and get a good level before we do that. We do that to you instead. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. We're just constantly slowed down here. Oh my God. What is even slowing me now? What is that? Webbed? Are you kidding me? Spiders? Really? All right. Here we go. Boom. How close are you? You're getting really close and dead. Awesome. We got five glands from you. All right. Let's just back up. Hit this dude. Sweet. So one Reaper Queen down. Is there any more in this area? Hmm. I hope so. Spider, stop it. Okay. Are we good? Let me... Can I... Can you not... Can you not jump to the tentacles? You would think that you'd be able to. Those things are nasty, man. Holy crap. What the hell did Rockwell do? Why does he have his tentacles everywhere? Rockwell, clean your room. Oh my god. He's even got little ones. These are the ones that are in the boss fight. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. 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 And let's do one of those. Okay. Freaking. Are we good? Like, they just keep coming. They never stop. They really, they just never do. All right. Let's go ahead and kill you. I'm super laggy right now as well. Could not imagine doing this area with a, uh, like, just anything that's not at least half decent i mean obviously i've got a really good pc and i'm actually kind of struggling in here for some reason holy crap all right oh you know what this is probably like the perfect time to mention this but we're partnered with apex gaming pcs on this channel and if you guys want to head on over to their website you can find some pcs that are very much capable of playing arc link down below so yeah we're just uh we're gonna search around hopefully we can find one we'll have to wait and see what we got down here that's a little tone to the other area that's a queen right there hopefully this is a good level you are a 156 that's pretty good but i want a higher level i'm sorry <laughs> 156 is great but like i want something better oh i can see the summoner dude i think oh crap okay that one got me instead i thought the other one was gonna get me but no let's just uh jump on out of here because screw that don't want to deal with that no thank you sir all right, let's grab these. What is that? Is that a queen? Is that the same one? What the hell? Why did you just... Okay, that is the same one. Why did it just... Oh, go away. No. <laughs> Leave me be. Leave me be. All right. Oh, my God, buddy. Rockwell, you need to stop this. This is too much. This is far too much. All right. Is this queen following me? I don't think she'll follow me up here. Probably not anyway. Let me let me get over here let me just get everything set up <laughs> oh my god all right hang on hang on let me get over here are we good we go ahead and kill this thing okay um let me see oh crap seriously okay whatever let me see can we just like drop this thing straight off okay we could bring it back to the other area but down here might actually be safer to be honest even though there will be a lot of tentacles down here you can actually, um, you can come down here and harvest up Mutagel. It's those little blue things there. Won't be doing that right now. Is that the one? Holy crap. Did that thing follow me all the way over here? I don't know if that's it. That might be a different one. That probably is a different one, to be honest. Okay. Let's go ahead and just deal with these guys. They're so annoying. It's like constant damage down here. It's honestly kind of insane. Lucky there's some water and we have a creature that has hydration buff because we can heal a little bit quicker using that. Um go ahead and deal with this dude can you die already there we go awesome what else is hitting me here what oh what oh is that the reaper wait what oh it's the reaper it's the reapers in the ground it's like a shark what how do i get it to come out uh oh i actually don't even know if that's it what what is happening why is the reaper in the ground don't be in the ground what are you doing down there i can't even see you oh there you are hello um hello good sir i almost called you sir uh well there's a lot of acid now 
What is happening? Why is it in the ground like that? Can you get out of there? Uh oh. Well, this may not be the best place to do this. Maybe we should try and. I don't know if we can move it. It just came out of nowhere. That might not even be it. Like, this is how little I know right now. Oh, yeah, no. It just keeps hitting me. All right. Great. Uh, let's run over here. Can I get you to come out? Where are you? even are you? I can't even see you. All right, let me go up here. Maybe it will come out if we're up here. I have no idea, but it's like it's there and it's constantly hitting me. What's happening? Okay. Boom. All right, where the hell is this Reaper then? There it is. I saw it. I just saw it. Will it come out now? Hey. Where are you? Well, the acid's coming again. I have no idea what the hell just happened. It's like in the ground somewhere. It might not even be there. That might not even be it. Like, this is the thing. It might have been it. Like, it. they do follow you for quite a a bit i don't know that actually possibly could be the 174 and it might have just died i have no idea this is where we were i think it was like over here i just saw a little disturbance in the ground i don't think that was it that might be it right there though and we've got a summoner on us right now that's not great let's go over here just uh oh what the hell oh i went into k mode that was weird all right so that that's probably the reaper i'm not even gonna look for the moment i'm just gonna keep moving um oh my god it's so fast okay all right let's see that's it right no it's a 160 what the hell there was a 174 i want that one i mean 168 is great as well don't get me wrong but like there was two high levels in the exact same spot like what the hell are the odds i don't understand okay well now you're down there too oh maybe not oh no goodbye great all right, so let's figure this out. Let's figure this out. Is, what is that right there? Is that, I, have no idea. I don't know what's happening right now. Let me see about trying to do this. Okay, maybe I should put away the shadow main. Okay, it's in the acid, kind of, sorta. All right, we need to watch out for that. All right, I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna move far enough away if I can, but like there's so many fucking tentacles and stuff here. Is it even safe to actually hop off and mount? Probably not. Considering absolutely everything goos you anyway, like they're gonna just knock me off and I'm gonna fall down into the acid when it's there. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know if this is really truly safe right here. Man, this is a tricky method. All right, let's, uh, let's just try this then. I just took you boys down. I'm gonna just assume the 174 is gone. Because, like, I don't know where it would have went. I think the Reaper just is about to die there. Oh, my God. It's already down to, like, nothingness, I think. Kind of looks like it is anyway. What freaking health are you on there? This is... Oh, okay. We don't want to get hit by that. Don't want to get hit by that. Okay. What health are you on? I need to check. Let me Helena you. Oh, the acid's coming. So this is probably what bugged it out last time, I would assume. The fact that the acid rose and the reaper was maybe under it and then it just glitched it out completely or something. I have no idea. Let's go ahead and just put that on just in case. I think it's gone. Oh no, there it is. It's still there. That's the one that What is happening? Oh my God. All right, well, you know what? Let me keep this thing out then. We'll just... uh. We'll just chill here, wait for some more acid. This acid comes in and, and goes out really quick, so we need to... Ah, oh, crap. Will it come out? Oh, it can't come out of the water or it's acid. You know what I mean? That's still the 174. Okay, so yeah, it is draining down relatively quick. I'm wondering if I was to pull out a charge pet, would it go down quicker? I would think so, because like that's straight up damage that it's taking, right? Oh, and also that's good because when it's, um, oh no, it can burrow if, oh wait, no, the acid went down again. Oh my God, that stuff comes up and goes down really quick. Rockwell clearly needs some like freaking Galvascon or something like this. Cause like, this is just crazy. Rockwell, are you suffering? 
Do we need to get you some heartburn? Ah! We need to get you some heartburn medicine. Will it help relieve you? There we go. Okay, great. Now it's under there again. Or is it? No, it is not. I don't even understand at this point. Let's just wait it out. We'll just wait it out. See what happens. Um, we're just walking around. Oh, you know what? No, that's a bad idea. That is a bad idea. Do not fly above the acid. If I had just gotten knocked down, I probably would have just died. And also there is potentially another Reaper over there somewhere. Yeah, I can see the 168. I can't believe there was like two in the same area. That's crazy. And the 168 is totally coming over here now, isn't it? Yeah, now we're going to have two of them. Oh my god. What? Which one are you? You're still the 174. Okay, good. I'm going to try and keep this thing out. I, I don't really want to just like stand up here. I don't know. It might be able to swing and hit me. We don't want that because like I only have one shield with me. Okay. Okay. It's not able to hit me because it's, uh, it's in the mesh kind of sort of. Oh, now it hit me there. Okay, now it's gone back in. <laughs> so temperamental. I wonder if I could grapple to that. That would actually be really handy if you could. I don't know if you can. Let me, um, let me chill up here. Can I, like, stand on this bed? Yeah, probably. There we go. Will it come out, though? No, because we're not close enough. We'll try and get a lower bit right here. Is this close enough? There you are, Mrs. Reaper. Hello. Is that you? Yes, it is. Okay. So it's just going to take a bit. Um, I'm going to just assume that if we did have a light pet, that would go down quicker. If anybody can confirm that, please do write that down below. Because it would definitely be kind of nice. Like, even not a, maybe not even a light pet, but like, um, plant species Z, uh, fruit. You know, the ones that you can throw, the flashbangs? If I had those, that would be good. Like, if the Reaper's in charge, does it take extra damage? That is the question that I have for you guys here today. Where is the Reaper right now? Um, so that's the only way for the Reaper to get at. So we need to get it to go over there. Uh, there it is, maybe? That's it, right? Okay. We need the Reaper to be over here when we're, um, when we're getting down to the end of it. But yeah, look at that. It's going down slow, but we'll just, we'll just chill here. It's free! You see, that's the whole point of this, right? You don't have to use a creature to bring the Reaper down by health. You can just do it this way. Um, and sure, it takes a little bit. Um, probably could have done this already on my Shadow Main. But, oh, it's, it's coming out. But yeah, it's definitely, it should be possible, I would say. My only issue is that I would reckon that when we get down to the point where I'm going to have to, you know, try and actually get the pregnancy to happen, that's the part that I'm worried about because I only have one shield with me. So I might have to potentially... I might end up dying, so that would be bad. We don't want that. Nobody likes dying. All right, let's, uh, we'll just chill here. I don't know. Is it going to come back out? Maybe. All right, so I'll just bring you guys back when this thing is down completely to probably like 5k, maybe less. I don't really know. All right, so it's down to basically like 2k health. Oh my god, this is the scary part. Um, so at this point, oh crap. Gotta kill those things. Um, at this point, we we need to wait for it to do its uh, its little sniff attack thing without trying to get hit too many times, if possible. This is gonna be kind of tricky. Gotta watch out for those ones, basically. Okay, you know what? I need to kill the snake and also gamma up. That's too far. Gamma three, there we go. A little bit better. A little bit washed out, but whatever. Oh my god, snake, die already. There we go. No, nope, you still got health. Uh, my mouse just went on the screen. That really needs to stop. That's been happening a lot lately, and I don't know why. Uh, where... There she is. Okay. Oh my god, buddy. Go away, please. There we go. Almost. And dead. Awesome. Um, let's see. Okay, hopefully we can do this. Where... Where is she? There she is. Okay. What health are you on? We gotta hopefully not let you go into the acid too much more because you will probably just die immediately. Oh, she's doing it. No! Wait, I killed... Wait, what the hell do you mean I killed a 168 queen? What the hell did I do? Oh, I just did it, by the way. Did you see that? Oh, I have no idea why apparently I killed a 168. Maybe it's because I was the last person to damage it before it went in. Or last source. No! 
Oh, luckily there's no acid. Okay. Wait, is that thing's not glowing anymore, is it? No, it is not. Oh my god, it just... You know what happened? It's the stupid mantis. It just healed off that mantis. Yeah, it's not glowing anymore, and, and it's already healed. Oh my god! Dude, there's so many things just appearing. All right. We gotta wait for this thing to go down by some more. So yeah, that might be... This acid might work the exact same as, like, lava. So if you guys didn't know, with, like, lava, like, the stuff on, like... Obviously, I know everybody knows what lava is, but, like, there's two different types of lava in Ark. There's the type that will instantly kill you, which I don't think exists too much more in the game. I think they removed it from most maps. But then there's also the type that uh, slowly wears you down from, like, Genesis. The type of stuff that you breed your guys in, your... What do you call them? Oh, man. All right, we're good, we're good. Your magma swords is what I'm talking about. So that type of lava, if you were to hit something... Oh, my God, Stop! I can't have like a moment's peace. I legit cannot have a moment's peace. Go away. Go. Get, oh, get out of here. Herd. Go, 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 go. Please go. Thank you. We're gonna have to chop you up. So anyway, back to what I was trying to say. Um, the type of lava that you find on Genesis is the, uh, is the good type of lava. Cause if you were to knock something in, is this Reaper still here? And then it was to die in the lava, then technically you get the hit, the kill. There's the Reaper. Okay. And it's getting there. It's getting close. It's getting close. We're good. We're okay, at least. Um, it actually might be almost down by enough in a second here. Oh, it's so close. Oh. Oh my, seriously? Really? Can we not have a moment's peace? Is that not going to be possible? <laughs> Look at all this stuff. Go away. Simply just go away. All right. Hopefully we can uh, get this done. Hey, bud. Oh, don't go back into the lava. <laughs> Acid. Acid. You know what? We should probably just move this thing out of this area. Not a good spot for it. Also, it is not down by enough, apparently. Great. Oh, here we go. Yes! Oh, you know what? I wanted to put on the dinosaur costume for this, but that just wouldn't have been possible. There we go. Now we should immediately try to kill this queen if we can. No, we probably can't because we don't have a charge pet. All right. Now we need to get out of here. Um, let's see. Let's just start flying. We should try and put away this stupid shield. We can still fly with it though, right? We just can't power punch, but that's okay. So I want to get out of here. And you may be wondering why it's only seven minutes for me. That's all based on your egg hatch speed, I believe. Oh, I'm probably wrong. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Is this gonna kill me? Oh, no. We're good. We're good. Um, we do need to get the hell out of here, though. We take that off. Start power running. We technically can die, and I could just come back from my stuff, but it would probably be easier if I didn't do that and if I actually got out of here. All right. So we're gonna go up this way. Wait, technically not fully up. Let's just keep flying forward here. All right, sweet. So we did it. We are pregnant. That's amazing. Um, I do need to get back to base ASAP, though. I'm almost kind of tempted to kill my character and um, just respawn and then come back for my stuff once we get out of here. That could be great because then I could just easily get myself leveled up um, and then, you know, and then birth this baby. <laughs> Wait, which side did we come down? I think we came down the other side, right? Oh, crap. I think we might have. Or did we? No, we came down this side, right? I think we did. It's been too long. Anyway, uh, let's see. It's kind of crazy that I somehow managed to find a 174 and a 168 like together in the exact same spot. So yeah, um, tip for that area, by the way, for getting Reapers is simply just keep killing the Queens. Um, that's it. And just kill as many other creatures as you can. Like usually that's the best way to get best the like really good levels uh, to spawn and everything. We technically don't need that. So let me actually just drop everything in. We're just going to drop it all in here. Um, even the tech suit. And I'm going to go get myself killed somehow. Uh, I wish I had some organic polymer. Also known as uh, respawn candy. Um, all right. I'll figure out a way to get myself killed here. It shouldn't be too difficult. There's probably something here that can kill me real quick. Then we're going to spawn back a base. We're going to hatch a couple eggs. And then we're going to use the babies to basically get myself leveled up. It should go really quick because it's all completely based upon your um i think it's the egg hatch speed i think 
I'm pretty sure it is. It's all based upon that, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I need technically need 50,000 XP, but I technically could do with less than that, so oh, yeah. Come on. I, was I should still be pregnant, that. unless they've changed something, in which case I'll probably cry, so here we go. Simple bed. Any second now? E, there we go. And we have a tech suit again. Love that. Really do. All right. We're still pregnant, right? What? <laughs> Why did they change that? What? Why did they change that? You were able to die before, right? You were able to die before. And now you can't? When did they change that? What? Or is it just different over here? What the fuck? <laughs> really? <laughs> really, game? You're really gonna do that to me? Oh my god! Now I know so many people were probably like, Sintek, what are you doing? Stop it, stop it, stop it! You were able to do that before! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I'm messing, obviously, but you know what I mean. Like, that is so frustrating! You were able to do that and now we're not? Like, since when? Since when was that a thing? Why is that a thing? Oh my god, why? That is not... Okay, the only other way of getting rid of a baby before was to either die um, in radiation or no, sorry, not die in radiation. Get exposed to radiation, or I believe upload yourself. Dying was not a thing that got rid of the baby. So unless this whole ship is designed to just instantly kill it, then I have no idea why the hell that happened. And now I have to painfully redo all of that. That's gonna be cool. Do I have any more riot shields? God damn, man. Nah, not good ones though. Yeah, okay, I'll take that one. That's so frustrating. When did when did they change that? When did they change that? Why is that changed? Why is that like that? Why? <laughs> that was not a thing before. God damn it. All right, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. You you learn things along the way. That really sucks though. What the I'm so annoyed. That is that is beyond annoying. That hurts so much. I just lost a 174. That hurts a lot. Yay. Love this. Love that. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> hey, editing syntax here. Uh, so yeah, at this point, I was actually watching some stuff. So obviously, I'm going to have to mute out that audio. But uh, yeah, we're just kind of like running around. And then we just get ambushed from behind by a Reaper Queen. I actually thought that other Reaper there was a Queen, but it turned out to be a King. So yeah. Um, that's basically what happened. All right, well, there we go. That is a 174 Reaper Queen. Amazing. Uh, before you ask, because I know there's definitely going to be questions, that cannot possibly be the same... God, I just burped there. <laughs> oh, my God. That cannot possibly be the exact same one as before, um, because when Reaper Queens uh, basically give you a baby, they pretty much just destroy themselves, I guess. They just kind of disappear into the ground and then never come back so that cannot possibly be the same one although as well i'm sure if we scan it it will definitely have some different stats unless they've changed something because apparently i don't know how reapers work on this map i mean i'm still blown away by the fact that uh well um <laughs> the freaking reaper baby just poofed it's just gone i even looked at the wiki and judging by the wiki you know it's going with exactly what i thought they do not uh go away when you die so Still, no idea why that happened, but it sucks, and we're just gonna have to get on with it. At least I found another 174. It is awfully convenient, but I swear, no shenanigans are going on here. Um, let's see, let's see. Well, we got a Basilisk here that we're gonna have to deal with, too, so... Ooh, did not mean to do that. Meant to do a super jump. All right, are you gonna be stuck down there yet, or... Okay, we gotta probably jump over here, then. No, 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 no. There we go. We're good. We're good. Did not expect that to happen. That was scary. That, by the way, you can see how much damage you actually take in there. That's insane. That honestly is insane. This freaking shadow man almost like half died there. Holy crap. We took like a thousand damage in like a second there. That's so crazy. All right. Let's kill this stupid basilisk. 
Oh, oh, what? Are you kidding? You're seriously out of range for that? Okay, whatever. It's fine. So annoying how basilisks do not show any blood, though. Super annoying. All right. Well, we already we already know what to do here, so I'll just see you guys on the other side when we have this Reaper Weddy Weddy this Weepo Weddy to give me buff. There we go, Jonathan Wass here. <laughs> oh, here we go! Come on! Yes, it caught me. Here we go. I won't screw it up this time, I promise. At least I I don't even think I actually screwed up the last one, but whatever. I'm just gonna shoot it and see if we can still kill it. No, oh, damn. All right, here's where we need to have the shadow main. Boom. And boom. And let's get the hell out of here. Boom. Boom. How much did that give me? Good amount. Good amount. Boom. Boom. It gave me a good amount as well. Drop out another. We're at 36 right now. I think we need to get to 55 and then we'll be good, right? Yeah, just a little bit more. Okay, I'm really hoping we get a really nice looking king out of this. 70, oh, oh no, it's, is it 75? Or did they up it? Oh no, it is 75. Oh, you know what I was thinking? I was thinking of 50, I was thinking of 50 something because I remember, yeah, it was the XP that I was remembering. 52 is the XP that you need, it's so 75 levels. That makes sense because it's half of 150, which is the highest level on normal official difficulty. All right, let's go ahead and Chuck all of uh, my random stuff into here. I, can I do a backflip while pregnant? Yes, you can. Hell yeah. Stuck the landing and going to stick this landing too. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my God. Look at the colors on that thing. No way. No way. Look at that thing. All right. We got to claim it. Oh, we got a such a cool looking one. Here we go. I'm gonna let it kill me. That means it takes all the food and stuff out of my inventory. That's good. It will also weigh it down. Um, if you're if you're wanting to keep them still, that's a great way of weighing them down. Here we go, and we have a fresh tech suit. All right. I want to see this little baby. I want to see it. All right. So um, here's something that you can do. Um, if you're on official, you can go ahead and put it into a cryopod, which means that uh, it will stop attacking you. Definitely would recommend that because these things can be pretty fiery. Let's go ahead and just open up the top. I do not have cryopods on here, so I'm going to use what I do have, which is the soul bulb trap thingies. There we go. Cool. So that means that it's going to stop attacking now, so I can just chuck it out and observe. All right, let's see. Where are you, little guy? Oh, man. Wait, wait. What colors did we actually get? It's a little bit purple. It's a little bit kind of gray, I guess. Is that that color? A little bit maybe like brown? ish and then orangey red although it looks very red to me at least it did oh my god look at that thing that is so cool looking look at it look at it you're not looking look <laughs> it is so awesome though look at this oh my god that is an amazing looking reaper yes um this is the way guys this is the way uh <laughs> you need to come over here and get them on this map like so much cooler you don't have to wait for events to get cool colors Oh man, yeah, no. This is this is what I like. This is going to be absolutely fantastic. I cannot wait till it turns into the bigger form so I can see what it will actually look like. Because they have all those like little lines across their body, and I don't see any right now. So that probably means that um well, it's not showing them, I would imagine. So when it gets to that bigger form at 10%, it will stop attacking you, but it will also um it should also show those colors, right? I would hope so anyway. All right, cool. Well, um, here we go. Reaper um, imprinting slash raising should be going on here today. So I'll see you guys in a little bit when this thingy is probably either ready for an imprint or a 10%, either or. Oh my God, I completely missed it. What the hell, it changed colors. It's purple now. What? Why does it, why is it different? <laughs> what? Okay, that is so weird. All right, let me go ahead and put you away real quick and just take a little look at you. Did that mess up your imprint timer? No, it did not. Uh, I was about to actually look at its, um, yeah, we can probably do that. I wanted to just look at the colors. Oh, they're the exact same. I, I'm guessing, okay, I think I understand. I'm guessing that the color regions on the baby are completely different to the color regions on the adult, because that is the exact same colors in the exact same places, although it looks different. So now the red has kind of transferred to the tips of the spikes in the tail. The purple has kind of taken over a little bit. 
with like the the little pattern and then also like the main body um not as cool as the initial one i had if i'm gonna be completely honest i've got to be honest but i still do like it it is it is a very nice looking reaper a lot better than just you know the the plain kind of ones that we get on um on aberration so yeah let's go ahead and just chuck all of that in there apparently um so yeah there we go and it's gonna be ready for an imprint in just a few seconds here oh man yeah no that is a cool looking reaper i actually kind of like this color here with the is that, what is that it's kind of like almost like a yellowy color it's kind of odd looking um i do like it though it actually looks kind of nice um i do like that purple though that is really nice like throughout the whole body just not as cool as the red that we had before on the baby but it is still pretty nice all right, here we go. This thing's going to be ready for an imprint in a few seconds. All right, what are you going to need? And it's a walk. Awesome. Let's go ahead and just put you on follow. Try and catch this animation on cam if we can. Look at this little guy. Freaking Reapers, man. So awesome. I love these creatures. Like, they're definitely one of my favorites. There we go. There's the animation. Oh, man. I love that. All right. So, there we go. How much imprint did we get? 25%. All right. I guess that kind of lines up. Not really. Um, fair enough. Cool. There we go. Um, so, yeah. We're going to get this thing fully grown up. We're going to need a really cool name for it. I'm glad that I didn't ask before because it's clearly very different now. So, yeah. Uh, leave some cool name suggestions down below that kind of fit this build. And uh, we'll, we'll try and pick one. And, uh, yeah, we'll name it that. But for now, we've got to wait for this thing to completely grow up. Alrighty, so our Reaper is fully grown up now, and let's take this thing out for a spin. Oh man, I'm pretty excited for this. Oh, I freaking love Reapers. Alright, so first things first. Uh, I didn't know that was there. I, I figured maybe that they'd like wandered around. Oh my god, that's horrifying. Wow, really? That is kind of crazy. Yeah, look at these things. <laughs> Oh my god. All right. Well, that's that's kind of funny. Um, let's go ahead and just harvest from the middle. <laughs> oh, we missed one. Damn it. All right. Let's see. So, um, in terms of stats, actually, you know what? Let's just let's put this thing away for a second just to check it out properly. Um, in terms of stats, here it is. We got amazing weight. Whoa, 49 points into that. 41 points into stamina. And then 34 in melee and health. Really? I mean, you know what? It's not the worst. I mean, Reapers in general are already pretty good, but like, yeah. Not a super amazing one. Um, now, in my mind, I'm just thinking, you know what, Syntec? The very first Reaper that you would have got probably would have been better, but it's fine. We can, I can get over that after, you know, a couple drinks later on. I'll just, you know, fall asleep crying. <laughs> That's awful. Oh, man. Well, you know what? Whatever. At least we learned something here today. Do not trust... What the hell? How did that not hit? Do not trust the freaking game to just, you know, continue the same rules that it had before. Man, that is really annoying, though. Um, Maybe people already knew that. Maybe that has been like that for a little while. But from my perspective, from my experience, it was not like that. So I was under the assumption that I would be absolutely fine and that I was doing the smart thing. Unfortunately, that is not the case, but at least we learned something. At least you guys can take some valuable information away from this video. And that is, well, yeah, don't, don't do that. Don't, don't die. Even, I'm gonna just assume, like, if you get killed, that would also be bad. You know, people probably knew this. I would imagine that you probably would have already known this in general, but there you go. Um, it sucks, but it is what it is. All right, well, anyway, let's at least try to get some kills with this thing and level it up a little bit. Um, usually with my Reapers, I like to pump a little bit more health. Let's try and maybe get that up to like close to like 30k, I would say. But I think for the moment, we should probably just be pumping into the melee. Um, we should be able to find some alphas actually. Hmm. Could possibly go and look for some. Uh, alright, let's, let's do some little jumpy jumps. Oh man, freaking Reapers are insane. Actually, you know what? Here's something that I've really wanted to try. Let me actually grab out a Shadow Mane. The male and then a female. Do I have the male here? Oh, I left it up there, didn't I? Yeah, all right, never mind. I was going to go ahead and just uh, buff up my Reaper with the Shadow Mane, but yeah, we can do that another time. It's fine. Let's go ahead and just kill this little Diplocalus because it deserves it. Let's see. One of these for you. Boom. Let's give you one of these as well because why not? And for some reason, it split and went over there too. All right, let's get this thing killed. 
so yeah reapers are just definitely one of my uh most favorite creatures in the game like i said major fan of aliens so oh man just like this this whole thing i've probably nerded out over all this for so for so long and so many times in the past can we we still can't go underneath the water with these things can we no you can't unfortunately um but yeah no i i'm still a real big fan of these creatures like i know that there's probably better creatures out there i think in general like a lot of people don't even like using reapers over other creatures but i don't know i like them i definitely do they're just such crazy looking creatures um and especially over here i mean these are variants like this is cool this is really cool i really like that so gonna be really excited to eventually try to get some cool event colors out of this yeah that's right i'm actually talking about event colors because could you imagine like crazy blues and greens and stuff like this like that aren't in the natural colors of the reapers even on here like with this cool pattern and everything i don't know i feel like that could be really amazing so yeah that will be nice but uh i think maybe we should try and maybe get a couple more of these for the moment because as you guys know we're gonna go and try and fight rockwell pretty soon so might bring a reaper i don't know actually i feel like a reaper would be a really good creature for that arena because it's got such a large aoe like this attack right here would hit absolutely everything it really would like all those tentacles everywhere i could just keep spamming this and it's gonna probably like knock back all of those corrupted survivors and then you know it's gonna obviously hurt all the tentacles at the same time and then the fact that they don't take that much damage i don't know kind of just thinking that it could be a good creature to bring in but um we'll have to wait and see um another thing is this this is also a good candidate for code red the mission in case you're wondering because obviously it's a fast creature you can jump around with it and everything oh and by the way um i was of course reading the comments in the last video i had no idea that you could bring a tech suit into the life support mission no idea that definitely would have helped out a huge amount i just assumed because you weren't able to use it on code red that you wouldn't be able to use it in there either but apparently you you can so that's cool i guess we got to try that out at some point maybe we can do the alpha mission by using the tech suit because that would make it it would make it a hell of a lot easier to be honest all right let's see here we go oh no what the hell oh yes you're kind of messed up a little bit let me try and get you though no no you don't what the hell how are you able to do that really okay i'm gonna come for you okay you know what that's just rude that is just so rude um one that's reaper right, right? okay thanks uh one reaper that uh, i had in the past like a long time ago now but um i can never get over it it was um it was a full i think it was like a fully white reaper to be honest okay i'm never gonna catch that thing it was a fully right white reaper and i called it neomorph and it looked like the coolest thing ever I would love something like that on here with maybe like red as like the little pattern that we see there like the little lines going along it that would be amazing i feel like that would probably be one of the best combinations for colors on one of these r reapers but um yeah i don't know we're, we're gonna have to wait for a cool event and hopefully those will be the colors maybe christmas we'll see all righty here we go hello mr bronto this is the best way to level all right how many we got a good amount of levels actually let's go ahead and do that boom we're doing almost 100 extra damage now which is great come on i don't know if we're gonna be able to find any alphas to be honest like reapers are pretty fast creatures but like i don't really see too many alphas down in this area here they're usually like really deep into this biome at least i mean i think they are i don't know i definitely don't see too many around this area though let's uh try and get to that river over there hopefully we can try and at least fight one alpha raptor that would be great so i'm gonna keep looking and i'll bring you guys back when we is that one i think that might be one yeah no that thing's way too fast to not be one right or is it no that's not oh my god the thing looks so fast i don't know why all right well fair enough uh never mind <laughs> oh my god still haven't found any alphas but we're fighting strider right now although they don't really give anything in terms of xp and they don't give any resources for killing so definitely not the most worth it creature to kill but we're doing it anyway just for the explosion that they do um i think one of the best things about using reapers on like a map like this or just any other map that is an aberration is uh well you have the benefit of not having to run around with a charge pet on because you don't have to deal with a bunch of creatures that would need you to have a charge pet to deal with like nameless or other reapers so definitely a uh, crazy creature to use on maps that are not well basically aberration that's the only one uh really there's no more nameless on any other maps i'm actually really glad that there's no nameless on this map i would have been not too pleased about that um but there we go boom wait for it 
My Reaper does 1 million damage. Whoa. Amazing. Everything's like, you know. <laughs> that could be the title. I'll put I'll put a couple red arrows in the thumbnail. There we go. That's some solid clickbait right there. How many times have I made that joke? Jeez. So guys, that is going to be it for today. If you have enjoyed this video, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button, and we'll catch you next time.